Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation, this is Mech Armada, a turn-based tactics roguelike featuring custom-made mechs that you pilot into battle, which I am incredibly excited to check out. It's so up my alley. Uh, before we get into this at all, I want to make it incredibly clear though, we are sponsored by Lion Code Games. People who've been around this channel for a long time know that if I take a sponsorship, it's only because I can say whatever the heck I want. Uh, all I gotta say, comes out in early access August 10th. If you want to pick it up, link at the top of the description. Let's get on into this and check this bad boy out. Swarm invasion confirmed Did worldwide. You know we never Ooh. found out where they came from. They're extremely ruthless. So many people dead. Families. We killed thousands. Millions. Then we ran out of bullets and they kept coming. Oh, oops, sorry. I, that was me. I turned, I was turning Looking down for a second. For an answer. They called me crazy. Oh. They were happy hiding in their holes. But this is going to work. My self replicating molecular nanotechnology can spawn giant robots out of pure energy. Oh. I need your help now. Someone has to control this thing. We're going to keep sending out mechs until we win. And we will win. Oh my god. He looks so good. <laughs> he looks so good. And not just because he's a hunk. Holy mole. Ah yes. I'm going to show you how to operate the mech armada. All right. Left click on your mech and Oop. advance to the energy tile using left click again. Hmm. Hmm. I will say, yeah, I wanted to just turn down the volume. Just a, just a touch for myself there. All right. Up we go. We're done for now. The <laughs> All right. All right, that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for the sponsor. Yeah. When you oh. left click on them. Okay. Now end your turn, and your mech will collect three energy points. Okay. We got our range right here. All right. Select on Swarm to check the range, and then end turn. Good deal. Swarm. It's time to test out your weapons. Let's show them what we can do. Select your mech, activate the weapon under actions, and select the swarm to fire. Okay, so wait, the range is the range is a bit bigger. Is it because we didn't move? Since we didn't move, we can uh, we can attack at a further range. Is that what it is? Uh, all right, double double. We just. All right. Oh no, it moves us. Okay, actually, that's nice for this quality of life. This is the key. You can spawn more mechs I'm using so the energy you collected. Choose a mech blueprint from the left panel and spawn it next to your mech. Ooh. Okay. Mecho Mecho two. Oh no, mech two. Move further on roads. Cannot use rough tiles. Has the machine gun. All right. Spawn it from the left panel. Spawn it next to your mech. I mean, if we spawn it on this energy tile, does that they help take us a out? Turn to power up. Okay. Ah, yes. And keep an eye on the energy cost. It increases each time you spawn the same mech parts. Okay. Okay. You can take it from here. Once this battle is won, I'll show you what else the mech armada can do. All right. So, let's see, your, is this your, this is your move range, that's your attack range. Okay, so we're actually completely safe if we don't move. We could move one more tile, it looks like, but again, unless I'm being misled here, it looks like uh, we should be totally fine. Oh, he's blue, hello. Can we have ah, custom excellent. paint jobs? I want flames on my mech, that thank you. indicator predicts what the swarm will do. They'll go after that mech next turn. Unless you do something about it. So it's only it's only you, right? Unless you do something about it. Uh, range. So you've got a really dinky range. We kind of probably didn't make a very good choice there in putting him back behind us. Uh, so your range is up there, up there. So if we move, like, we can move, like, one to the side. We're not in danger. We couldn't, we couldn't have attacked, wait, could we have attacked? Because how much damage does it do? It does four. We could have killed, I guess, 
if we could have gotten range, I guess. Eh, it's fine. It doesn't really matter. The only thing that happens is the turn will take just ever so slightly longer. No, yeah, he's got to be in one tile radius. He's a very close range boy. Wrecked. Perfect. Well done. Ooh. Ooh. This is the I like this screen a lot. Center. After each battle, you'll collect energy points and engineering credits. Use the credits okay. to improve your mechs by developing new parts. Go to engineering now and select a new weapon. Select a new weapon. All right. Range two damage three times three to five. Is that true? Like it'll do up to like it could do nine to 15. Is that true? That seems not right. Is it like a... Uh, well, but at the same time, it's a minigun. What, like, it's... It should fire multiple times in, in one turn, I would assume. That just seems too good. Especially compared to this. Six damage, two range. Okay, the difference is this only costs one to spawn. This costs three to spawn. So do we want, like, a little dinky thing? Also, it's a missile pod. There's, there's a world where that's an AoE attack. There's a world. I, I gotta go with the minigun, though. I gotta... Good choice. Legally now, obligated. Let's it so we can use it in battle. I'm sure you didn't Go mean to do that. Mix, select a blueprint, You're right. And you can swap weapons. Select a blueprint. Are these my blueprints? These are my blueprints. Okay. So it increases the spawn cost by three. Is so that what you're telling you me? I love how he's just like, he's a minigun on wheels. Be mindful. <gasps> Each part is oh. different. Ah, yes. And remember this. Blueprints are not the same as mechs. You Lights have to color. use energy to spawn mechs in the field. And changes to blueprints won't change your real mechs. You can do this. Let's show them what okay. the mech armada can do. Oh! We can change them! I mean, I kind of like Mecha 01 and Mecha 02. I am a simple man. Lights color. Okay, so it's changing that down there. Oh, hell yes. This is the screen I wanted to see. I, I'm a sucker for this. Um, what is the difference between these two here? Uh, I took away <laughs> took away the weapon. Oh, it's because it was in use with the, the other one. All right, was the double-double or the machine gun? I guess we'll go with the double-double then. Look at that. Yeah, it's it's because it's in use. Did I uh did I take away your your part here? No. Okay, I am uh I am an eager beaver looking forward to uh getting some new parts. Uh I played the hell out of Custom Robo, Oft Forgotten Gem, and uh I'm ready. Okay, so yeah, these ones won't spawn or it won't change, that's what they're saying. But every other one we change. Okay. So we keep it even if we lose all the mechs. Meta energy. We can use it for improvements. I'll call it meta energy. You'll need to get to it before the swarm does. Oh, yeah. oh okay. What you have to care about, meta meta progress energy swarm? I'm gonna move both forward like this, so we can uh, we can spawn them around us here. Ah yes. If you make a mistake moving, you I never made undo mistakes. It. However, I will totally, I'll just make a mistake right away. Actions. All right, so that's gonna be showing up next turn too. I'm oh, super excited. Like I actually, yeah, this is. Oh, look at this squad. We got the squad rolling up here. Oh my, I cannot. I actually cannot wait to see what kind of uh, other types of parts we we're gonna gonna get. Okay, so we're actually safe there. I don't think we'll be able to... Actually, you can probably hit him, but if we do that, you have to move. So the range is 1, 2. So if we move... Right, it's range 2. We'd have to move there. Are we in danger there? We are in danger there. So there's a couple things we could do. We could move here and keep just outside their range so they have to approach us and then we get uh, a better blast on them. We Obviously, we will not get this battery uh, this turn, but that might be just okay. We'll move you down a little bit right here. We can scrap him for one. I mean, I'm fine with it. I think that we'll just... Oh, look at them. Look at them goofs. 
All right, so they're going to attack me. We have the uh, we have the ability to blast them. Two times two to five. Is that right? That seems so good. Is that what you were doing? Two times two to five? Do you have like a defense or something? Is that why? No, it's just... All right. Four and two? No, it's just straight up. That That's accurate. Let me get the meta energy. So we can attack and then move. No, but we couldn't, we couldn't in that situation. The good news is we had lethal anyways. There was a chance we could have rolled a two and a two, a two and a three, a three and a two. All of that would have been uh, a problem. Okay, so... We have 22 chips. Transport body. Oh! Impervious. Has two weapon slots. Resist debuffs. Spawn cost of five, health of eight, armor three. One less move. So this is a this is a tank. Health five, one weapon slot. Can use this game is so slick. Oh my god, this is such a clever interpretation of a uh, of the mech building format in this in this kind of a kind of a game. I'm I'm jazzed. So we get to pick one of these. We can either get a shield plus seven shield for one turn. Adds two to the spawn cost, or we can get an airstrike. Let's get it. Let's make ourselves a tank. Can we make a new one? We can. We would have to. Uh, we'd have to research a new transport because we don't have one right now. Move further on roads. Can't use rough tiles. Can move diagonally. Let's do it. Oh, I'm excited to make my my weird uh, about that. Don't make uh, don't make mistakes. Things. Let's just let's not. Does this the does the machine gun add? It does not add any. Oh my god, I love him. Oh my god. Oh, I can't do Thick Borg 9000. Uh, oh. But he is definitely thick with two Cs. Fine. Thick Bot 900 it is. I that is a that is an absolute shame. Thank you Thick Bot. 9,000. What is this plus here, by the way? Like, is that just signifying that I could make another another bot if I wanted to? Gain seven, seven credits at the end of battle, five batteries at the end of battle. I mean, we can get more. So there's also the upgrades here. We can just straight up upgrade one of the ones we have here. Um, I don't know. I feel like thick, thick bot is getting pretty expensive. He costs nine to spawn. It's quite a bit. Quite a bit. Uh, okay. I mean, I can't wait till we one day could get to 9,000. One day. Uh, um, hmm. Should we just develop a couple more parts here? What the hell? Attack again after a kill. Ooh. Regen 3. I'll get the, I'll get the attack again after a kill for now. All right, one of you guys want that? Oof. The cost would go up quite a bit, though. We would get an extra weapon slot, but I don't really need an extra weapon slot right now. Spawn one battery times two. So does it normally cost one, but since we've cast, uh, we, we have two of them on the field? Is that how it sh is shaking out? Is it is it doubled up that way? I need Thickbot in my life. Hello, Wrecker. Quiet down, quiet down now. I could scrap one of these and make a thick bot. Right now, there's no real danger here. I do want to move through the battery. Okay, are we going to be in danger if we move right? 
Oh, boy. Could we possibly reach you? We can't. I do like that this is here. That That's smart. That's smart. Because otherwise, I really, really, really would want to just stand still. More or less. Oh, shoot. It's at the end of the turn. It's at the end of the turn. Is that worth it so we can make thick bot? Can we even... Can we make it to that... Sp well, first of all, we can't even make it to that tile. The good news is he might not even be trying. And we should be able to make it there next time. He has one more move. So I think we do something like this. Since he's he's got to be a lot closer... Don't you dare take that meta energy. Oh, we're golden. How much Come HP? On. Eight. See that fog coming toward you. It's oh. getting closer every turn you take. There's a chance we're just fine here. To be Two and four. I'd advise staying away from it. What's your deal? Okay, so we actually we can move here, so we'll do that. We will not get the battery, but the good news is we can probably yeah we can get here. We can land on that t uh, that tile at the end of this, and we'll get the battery at the end of the turn here. This is slick. This is slick. Oh, God. My son. Oh, my God, my son. You killed him. Understandably so. I was a little haphazard. The good news is, one, we can attack here for free. We might be able to just kill, though. But alas. Beep boop. Welcome, thick bot. Uh, so is he going to come over there and attack me in the corner there? Is that what you're saying? Oh. No! No, my son! This guy is brutal. Seven shield for one turn. I mean... Get him, thick bot. Oh, no. You killed my son. Zzz. You killed my son's plural. Uh, okay, so... We have two out of five there. Should I make just like a straight up new Mac? We have... Do we have any new parts? We have, we have the new body. We have like the multi-chain attack body. Give me a weapon. Energy shield. Five shield and counter 50% damage. That's interesting. Missile pod attack tiles in an area. Spawn. That's interesting. We probably should go more for upgrades, I would imagine. Yeah, we can't get anything else here. Kind of... I think that maybe we could rock a little bit... Oh, look at him. Oh, look at him. How much does this add? Spawn. Does it turn it into four? Is he a four cost now? Yeah, he could. He, or, oh, 13. Oof. Let's take that off for now. He's down to a nine cost. He looks a little funny. I like him. Oh, my God. He is my favorite now. Uh... Let's see. Uh, <laughs> uh, he's the Tuna Borg Mark One. All right, everybody. Everybody gets a name when they be, they have enough character for me to want them to have a name. Welcome Tuna Borg, Mark One. Okay, so, oh, we got some Rhino Tars. Not a very mobile boy, Tuna Bot. Oh, we got really, we're getting really choke pointed, too. 
let's actually just triple undo that for a second. Oh, you really... Oh. Yeah, that's the plan. I don't love it. I don't love it. I like that we can do all that stuff, uh, and then we can just end our turn before the actions even come out. I do like that. Uh, what's your deal? I feel like you can... They can attack very in a very far distance in a straight line. Seems to be the deal. Is there... Oops, hold on. I guess I'll... I'll wait to check. I'm curious about uh, what, what kind of settings we got here. Show timer... Moving with action selected and turn confirmation. Because that's the thing. I was going to say, like, seems uh, seems like maybe the moving is a little bit slow. But I guess the thing is, if I can make my actions and then press end turn, it doesn't... It's not actually... It's not actually that slow. Because there's no... It's not slow at all then. Uh, you do 8 to 12 and knock back. We would have to step in, in line to do that, huh? Really? I don't think we would. I do want that Metaprog stuff, but... What? What's your range like? It's pretty, pretty eh. step out of the out of the way there i feel like we're actually safe here so the thing is he's not he, he'll slowly move closer this is not my favorite this guy's gonna need to move tunaborg is gonna have to move so how much does this do it does three times three to five so it is a it's a guaranteed kill and then we can attack again So, I think that we might have, yeah, but it's a range of two. That's the issue. We could attack again, but we're not going to be able to get, really get the option. That being said, oh, I love that we could though. Theor the theoretical possibility that we would be able to is so nice. And then what's your damage? Four flat. Uh-oh. It's your time, thick bot. I'm I am curious to see. I am curious to see what knockback does, because it might be a problem. Resist debuff? Is knockback a debuff? I do want to pick up the meta energy anyways. So this is good that this worked out this way. Oh my god. Alright, get that meta energy. Bye bye. Oh my Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh no. All right. So I know we don't need to make more mechs, but like I kind of want to make more mechs. We've got we've got a body and a weapon. We need we need a new transport. <laughs> Move after action. Can move after action. Mega Walker. Eight health. I mean, like. I think you might need an upgrade there, Thick Bot. Oh, oh my god. Oh, Thick Bot. Yes. Yes. Alright, so we got a new. We could make a new one. What, what would it be? It would be. We have the ability to move diagonally. Eh, dinky basic basic thing there. And a missile. Eh, it's, I'm not going to sit here and say that this has no value. Alright. We should probably start to use our things for upgrades instead of different mechs, though. Boss battle. All right, squad. Oh. New thick bot in town. Okay. Okay. So what's your range like? It's pretty disgusting. Hmm. It's 
crawler attacks three tiles in a row in a row row meaning uh i'm assuming yeah since he can move there in a line like this otherwise this so this is column and this is row in this in this in this perspective gotcha i you know i'm a i'm a little terrified tuna borg roll out oh you are so slow God. Hello there. Oh. I kind of want to... Wait. One, two... So we... We can't move diagonally. Can we? Is it... I mean, like, I know we could do this, but this is... This is too... That's too movement. It counts as two movement, so do that for now. I could go in. How close would you have to get go in? A little too close. Okay. It's about to hit the fan. I know that there's an action available. I know. I don't know if I'm ready for combat there. We can take damage. We take damage on this tile. And he does six damage, so it would be a one-shot on him. I it's just not. I know. I hate I hate that I, I hate that there's action available, but this is It's an unpurpose. It was an unpurpose. Okay, so you have ten health. There is absolutely a world where we kill here. Oh baby. Oh, you don't have, you don't have, you don't have move after, after action. Shoot. That's a, tis a bummer. Well, this will hit both of them. That's kind of nice. We'll definitely do that. Oh! Beep boop. Rest in hell. That was not quite what I needed it to be. All right, um... How much did you do? 12 damage. So. Move after action. So we can... I'm trusting you, game. I'm trusting you. Whew. All right. We've done it. We've shielded. All right, let's go. Come on, thick bot. You can attack both of these, can't you? No, okay. I thought that maybe he would attack in like a big radius or something. But no, we're good. Oh. Okay, that was not quite how I was expecting that to shake out. Uh-oh. Does this do more than one damage to him? If we... I mean, you know what? To an extent... You can't make an armada without breaking a few eggs. Oh my god, it totally does count. That's beautiful. Alright, gang. You freaking heroes. 2 HP! What's he gonna do? My boy, Tuna Borg! <laughs> uh, it's only right, Captain. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was pretty cool. Um, so. What are we at here? Okay, good deal. Select an expansion. So we get a passive. All mechs recover all their health before the next mission. Plus one battery collected on energy tiles. Sure. Okay, so I know we have I know, I know we have that available. Maybe we should upgrade some of this stuff. I think we should upgrade something that we have. So let's be real. 
uh, thick bo thick bot thick bot 900 is already pretty dang good. Also, his stuff is more to upgrade, anyways. Armor up though. Oh my god, armor of three. I didn't even notice the armor of three. Up to an armor of six. That would be pretty neat though. That's an upgrade of roughly like two damage. Machine gun, shield, plus 10. I mean, hey. Uh, health up. Does not give, like, any of these give a movement up? Oh, they give, like, straight up new passives. Plus once per turn. Refund a movement after action. Ooh. Plus move after action. Pl once per turn. Plus one movement after action. It's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Decent, decent, decent. We do need a new tuna, tuna Borg, so we might as well make him stronger. We have the technology. All right. Show me what you got. Scourge Egg Evolve. I mean, I can only assume it's going to hatch. Target. So, oh wait, that's one of its attacks. Evolve. Okay. Evolve for damage. Target receives six damage in one turn. Some mechs can move faster on the road. Oh. Oh. Hey. There we go. It is not Thickbot. He is off to late to the party. Should we just let them come to us? As per usual. You know what? Let's give this a go. Woo! Oh my dang! Can you attack him? No. Ah! So close, though. Two in the Borg, if only. Is it worth it? I think it's worth it. Beep boop, get wrecked! Oh my god, Tuna Borg! Thickbot seems like it might be better as like a spawn in unit. Just this movement is just wretched. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Okay, uh, can we do any upgrades? Mini tracks. Who has, uh, what does Thick Thickbot have? Thickbot has these. Once per turn, refund after action. See, the thing is, if there's nobody around us, we don't get that refund. We might... Oh, two moves. Two move further on the road. It's just... Ah. Oh, I just love him just like that, though. Still have Mecha 1 and Mecha 3. They, they just... They haven't... They're not speaking to me yet. They're not speaking to me. We could spawn another one of these, but I don't know. I don't know if I care. We'll do it in the middle of combat if we need to. I'll, I'll save it. We actually also didn't get the meta energy last time. Okay, get you up. I mean, there is no way in which Thickbot sees the light of combat here. No world. Arthropods receive three armor. So I kind of want to... I need to get the centipede. Ugh. Centipede out there. <laughs> okay. We'll, 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 we'll leave it like that. I know. I know. I know.
Okay. He's sticking back there. I don't know. Maybe we just... Maybe just go for it. Plus three armor, though. That's kind of huge. That kills... Oh, that kills Tunaborg. And we can't really get back there and sneak in. High damage. Alright, what is this what is the range on this? It's two, right? Two. So if we went one, two. If we backed up right there, we'd be fine, but he's probably just gonna sneak back and attack us. But we don't have move after attack is the problem here. Let's see what we can do. There's a good chance we do zero damage. Yeah. Six. Wait, is this flat damage? This is flat damage. Six. Block three. So you're going to come up and attack me anyways, huh? Is that what I'm gathering? You, you say... So you're... Is it... Are you saying that you're going to attack him... Or is it just saying that either of them are in attack range? Because I do... Yep. Rest in peace. Creature that I have not quite named yet. I... Ah, God. You're... I hate that you're smart. I hate that you're smart, Centipede. Because I, I don't really have... Mobility is not my strong suit. You're a legend. Apparently, they can't get back there, so... We're all good here. Huge. Too thick to kill. Uh, attack again after kill. It. Kind of want to do, like, a little bit of... Hoping. Okay, good. Ideal. Can you move after? You cannot. Oh, that's a rough tile. Oh. Oh, this is bad. Uh, I'm assuming we could run back over through there. So I guess we'll do something like this just to make sure that otherwise we are going to get uh, get bodied. We might get kind of bodied anyways, depending on how much this centipede wants to run away from us. Okay, thank you. All right. Ouch. Kills instantly. Instantly. Oh. Well, you're you're alive at the very least. Oh, 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 we've done it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I forgot that the diagonal. So it means the the ones that can move diagonally take it does take just one. Oh god, that's so good. What do we got for upgrades? We have a much bigger range here. Uh, let's see. What weapon is Tunabots? Tunaborg. Sorry. Apologies. It's the minigun. After developing an upgrade, you can apply it to existing mechs for a small energy cost. Okay. Interesting. Do we do that in combat? Upgrades pending. For one battery. Yeah. All right. So do we want another mech? I, well, we don't know what they have. Move after action. I mean, I, I really like this guy. So sure. Resist debuffs. 10 damage. Pretty slow moving. I think the, we should have Thick Bot kind of moving up. Um, oh, my. 
Kind of just moving up diagonally. Concerning. One, two. What's your range? I think doing something like this is not a bad idea. Because if we can attack with the, the plane mech. Okay, we can move up there, and then we can just not reach. If we can't reach, then we might as well not go for it. I'd say we might as well do something like this. Or, or that, because you're going to move diagonally up. I know I could move closer, but I think that this is going to be better, because we, we're looking for the chain reaction, you know? So we start with the 2 to 5, and then there is a chance... It's not super likely. I mean, 12... Hey, let's go. It's a guarantee, a guarantee kill there, actually. Oh, that keeps getting me. That keeps getting me. Ah, we really need to remember which units can move after after attacks and which ones cannot. Uh, I kind of want to save your life, my friend, so let's just ensure that you really, really want him. Move after attack or no? Does not move after attack. Range of two. But arguably, we can kind of treat it like a range of three. One, two, three-ish. So we can move back one tile. If we move you here, then we can attack like this. No! I keep... I was trying to attack with the range of three. It's fine. Oh, my God. I'm an absolute certified dumb, dumb man. I kind of want to just shoot my friend and put him out of their misery. Oh, man. That was just... Because we can't undo it past that. Because whenever RNG is involved, like with the with the number generation there. Here, here we... Uh, here we got a little bit of a mistake. Attack again after kill. So we don't know... Let's see. We got... There, we cannot kill is the issue. We actually, we, we've put ourselves in whoopsie danger. So what's your range? Okay, so if we do something like this and then we spawn you, spawn that right there for next turn, we might be able to set up uh, a, t a one turn kill an OTK to make up only very gen just ever so slightly partially I mean you know you gotta do what you gotta do alright so move first then shoot please kill that was not a guarantee but it was like a mostly guarantee so we're gonna take three damage here is that what it is? You do 10? No, we have um, we have 7 armor as well. So we actually... Wow. That's nuts. You are... Thick bot is so thick. This, this one's OP. This one that we made is absolutely OP. I would... I would kill anyone who laid a finger on him. Oh my god. The little... Bot who could. Any upgrades of anything? I kind of want to roll the little... Uh, oh, I want to roll the loot box. Do you have names yet? I mean, you guys are just... Uh... <laughs> uh. Oh, fodder spider. <laughs> and then you're Mario. <laughs> uh, these ones have not been named. I wish we could upgrade them so we could just get their names. 
Uh, okay. I can't really tell where the bottlenecks are going to be. I'm going to assume something like that. All right. Is there a spot over there? There is not. What on earth? It's a hatchery. A hatchery and a snapper. All right. Spawn a snapper. The good news is Tuna Borg can kill anybody within his uh, his radius. Like, just in a row. Just just all, all at the same exact time. When Thickbot gets in position, well, he, is, he is slow as hell, but when he gets in position, oh my god. This is the level for, uh, for Tuna, Tuna Borg, though. Absolutely. Okay. Can you fly? You can fly over stuff. Okay. Could attack again, theoretically. But we can't not... Cannot actually. Can't not actually. Okay. One, two, three. We got an O-Baby a triple if we want it. And O-Baby, we want it! My boy! My tuna! Shaped boy! I don't think there's any other unit in range there. You can move up. Shield up. And that's about it. We can't really. And I think if we go here, you can move after action, which is good. Because we should be able to kill and then move out a little bit more. This is a rough, uh, rough batch of enemies for me to fight, though, because they th they demand moving. Okay. How far could they go if they were uninhibited? They can move one tile. So if I step here and I kill one, two, three, four, five. I don't I don't even I don't care about the consequences. It's too good. Oh my god. Beep boop. Screw the snappers. Oh, I'm so attached I'm so attached to this hunk of junk. I love him. Oh, he's a hero. Oh, I didn't even realize there was a there's a scourge here too. Truth be told though, we can move move over shield. Kill something anyway. Alright. Can you kill anything? You can kill that. So anybody who has And he's the only one who could theoretically get us there. Gotcha! How much damage does it do though? Oh you okay. Nope, there there's no no chance he can take no damage. Not possible to take no damage. Nice try, guy. Hmm. I think that moving here and getting this kill is probably a good idea. Standing here and getting this kill, I guess, is a good idea. So we can go for the shield into that kill. And the question is if we should move. I think we should. I think we should. Okay.
I uh, kind of like the idea of, could you move there, theoretically? Uh, this is a wild one. I'm, I'm going to do now, worry about later. He just kind of get it, gets in there and just does it all. Oh my god. Okay. So you can move. But you're safe. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, can you? You can't kill this one. Okay, so we could... I think we move here. Do a little bit of chain reaction. Let's start with the lower HP ones. If I don't know in what world we wouldn't be able to kill this thing, but maybe it has armor or something that I, I wasn't paying attention to. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my god. I really I'm really liking this. This is super clever. I like you know, it's got like a lot of elements of things that, you know, I've I have seen before, I've played before, but this like the the depth and really the ability to truly make this team your own and assign, you know, your own names and everything to them in every way. Like being able to do that feels really like I know we could have been spawning more robots we just didn't need to um but it's really easy to get attached to these these weird little little guys huh it's nice uh okay so do we have any extra parts let's okay we should probably get an upgrade anyways we could oh my god up to six I mean that's that is wild. It doesn't increase the cost or anything. After action. Wait. 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 Is a shield is shielding an action? Though like how much of a how much of a difference does it really make? Truth be told. That he's so slow. We've been able to get him up into combat every time. Fodder Spider, Mario. We are literally unable to make another one of these. I've realized now. Boss battle. I mean, we don't know where. Hello. Oh, hi there. Got some egg. What's your range? It's, it's huge. Don't get me wrong. It's very large. Get you right there. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty, punk. Stare down. Oh my god. All right, um, what's your damage? 10, and it also attacks the tiles around. Okay, okay, okay. Dangerous. I mean, we could actually, truth be told, we could take the hit. We could. Which is interesting. It's a very interesting idea. You know what? I want Mario, anyways. So you could attack there. If if I put you there, you're dead. If I put you here, we could do we could attack that tile. We could attack. Uh, theoretically, we could attack this tile and still hit him for six. 
But then if he attacked this, these would, these would both die. But I also don't really care about that problem. I will spawn an, uh, a Mario. But we could have waited, I guess. Eh, it's fine. Let's get greedy. Let's go for the meta energy. I just want to see what this looks like. Okay. All right. What could possibly go wrong? Who are you going to go for? Oh, awesome. Oh. Oh. Wait. Oh, tiles around around him. I thought it was around the, the one target. Okay. Oof. Okay, so we, I think we need to send a couple, couple fodder, fodder fools up in there. Twenty damage. Do you have any armor? Do you have any armor? Could we attack from here? Would we have to move? We would have to move up. I mean, we could. You move seven. That, that's super dangerous there, though. We can move you to the side. We can move you up. That actually... What does this look like? I mean, it looks like a double kill <laughs> on us to me, but we wouldn't be... Well, it's not going to be a double kill. We, we get another turn. Oh my god. Do we have lethal? No. Alright. Uh Yeah, it's okay. You can move right here and get us both, but I'm actually kind of fine with that. Because we get to kill now. First of all. Bye bye, boss. I'll admit, I thought there was a very real chance that it was just going to end after that, and now I am concerned. <laughs> Sorry, Mario. Okay. That's so good. We could just spawn a billion of those. I could go here. Get a double kill. You can't reach down there, can you? No. Good. I don't I keep on untargeting that when we don't need to. Shield up. Should I just, I, I mean, I guess I just, at this point I have to just wait for him to come to me. Uh, one, two, we can put him. I guess we'll make a Mario bot there. Wahoo! Oh! Let's be honest here. I think we can make lethal happen. Oh, absolutely. Bye bye. It's -a me. It's -a wrecked. It's -a me. Oh my god. All right. Gain one. Oh, gain one battery per turn, but you can't gain any batteries from tile. I kind of like that. Gain two armor if you didn't move the previous turn. Ooh. Per, wait, is it per per bot? Oh, man. All right. I'll, I'll be honest. My time for uh, how long I'm supposed to play for the uh, sponsored video is now up. 
but I want to play another round really bad, so I'm going to keep playing. Uh, I really, I really like this. Let's see here. I, kind of, I mean, we could, we could roll the loot box to see what else we kind of just get. I know there's a couple characters that can take an extra weapon right now. Medic drone. What? Range one, cooldown two, spawn repair drone. Has six health. Can fly over tiles. Can't move to next bat. Oh, oh, that makes sense. Uh, can't come to the next fight with us. I'll admit, I'm curious. I'll admit, I'm curious. Gives you a little bit more of a reason to... Have, you know what? No, I've been liking you. You're the little... Uh, you're the little helper spider. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Let's see. How do we how do we turn this how do we I have no idea. Uh I can't figure out how how to how to cleanly switch this over into a, a helper a helper role. Oops. There. He's father spider. He's a uh he has turned to a um a life of being a cleric. He's now Father Spider. Uh, address him as such. All right. Uh, when, uh, let's get another one in. Let's get one more in here. So you you are not. We do not have a Father Spider. Get in here, Father Spider. We still have the same thick bot nine hundred. It is the same one. This is our first thick bot. This zone is not made for a tuna, tuna board. Oh, look at that. How much does it repair for? Six? That's huge. And then what do you do now? Now you don't do anything. <laughs> now you don't do anything. I wonder, if, if this dies, does the medic drone die? God, this is so cool! Okay, uh, what's... What the hell? What the hell? Stun. Two turns. This, okay, so it has a ranged attack. Oof. I don't know if I want to wait all the way for that. We're actually... No, we're not safe. We're not safe anywhere. Um... We're, we're, we are quite honestly safe nowhere. Let's, let's wait for one more approach here. We can't wait too long, but I feel like having them be a little bit closer... Yeah, we'll, uh... Ugh. Yeah, they really, uh, they really are janking us up here. So, is it saying, like, they are going to attack them no matter what? Even though they technically could attack somebody else? Because technically he could attack him too, but is he not going to? Is that the thing? Because I'm fine with that. Resist it. Resist it. So if we don't take damage from it, we don't take the stun? Colossal if true. What's he do? You do eight. I mean, if you could do lethal, that'd be fantastic. Do you have armor? You do have armor. Do you have armor? You do have armor. Hey, everybody's starting to get armor. Oh, two armor really messes up Tunabot. I don't think we can make lethal happen. 
because yeah, four is our max on them then. Four damage, or sorry, yeah. It's uh, two to four then is what our damage goes to. If they have two armor. So it's, we have a max of 12 damage, so I would probably be wise to back you up one. As much as I would love to start blasting. Oh, you know I would love to start blasting. Um, two to five. There's a there's a there's a world, isn't there? Yep. One armor. Wait. Yeah, there there is a world. It's just very unlikely. We would have had to perfect RNG it. So your armor's up to 13. Nice. Uh, oh, no. My medic. Wait. No, that's, that is Father Spider. Oh, that's stun. Oh, that's stun. Oh, God, that's annoying. Eight. So I think we could... We can do this. I'm not going to say it's going to go well, but we can do this, and if he attacks us, we're not going to die. Okay. Definitely put that up, though. All right. All right. Ouch. Well, that, that answers that. Mario! <laughs> that, that stun is so annoying. All right, is there a world? So it's four damage. It could, it could be two damage. It could be six. So it'd be down to six. So, oh, geez. But I can't get to it like that. All right, heart of the cards. Let's go! Medic. Goodbye, Mario. Mario. I would love if this guy didn't move. A pipe dream. Wahoo! Alright, uh... You can't make it past, can you? No. Oh, I almost moved first. That would have been bad. I was like, hey, I wonder if I can move and then shoot. Oh my god. What if I just what if I what if I just open one more loot crate? What if I just open one more? That's fun. It's fun because it gives you kind of that feeling of like loot crate kind of vibes. Uh, but not really. Okay, just one more. Okay, just one more. Father Spider. Forgive me. Uh, holy danger. Eh. Okay. I should have... I mean, I guess I can't give Father Spider a, uh, a weapon. Father Spider exists only to uh, make this this guy. He's, he's a... <laughs> he's like a bona fide phone cradle, is what... Father Spider is. We can actually kill every single person here if they're in melee range. That the three movement thing is is the killer. Eight damage. Six to twelve. Tell you what we're gonna do. Th 
three spaces. One, two, three, and then you can attack here. One, two, three, and then you can attack here. So we're gonna move you back here. Move you back here. Can we do this after? You still in attack range. One, two, three. Oh, wait. Trying to, I'm trying to think how the movement is going to go. Is that what? Could I do this and then have him move, move, like move, move? I don't know how. I just don't know how that would go. So I'm afraid. I could also use Father Spider's Cradle, which sounds absolutely like a Dark Souls boss. I could use Father Spider Spider's Cradle, literally just as a uh, a blocker tool, which is kind of fun. Am I wrong? Is it the most is it the most effective way to be doing this? No. I see the meta energy, but I could save the medic. Wait. Wait, what? Is that saying you're getting attacked and you're getting attacked? Okay, that's fine. It looked like it was going to be Tuna Borg, which would actually ruin everything. We really do need to get up and get... Oh. Okay. So it can actually just... <laughs> it can just suck. Uh-oh. Why can't... I can't move diagonally? Because it's a rough tile. Ooh, no. That sucks. We can't get a kill without... We can't move and then get a kill. The good news is we can heal the, and we should get three static defense. There's a real world where we stay alive, I think. We just have to sacrifice our attack with you for the turn. Obviously, that's an attack. But then they're going to move close enough for us to get a double kill, theoretically. Yeah, I don't love that. Doesn't do damage, so I guess we could go over here and get this. It's a stun, which is really annoying, and I guess he could stun him. Yeah. Oh, you trash monster. I hate you. I hate you. I wanted to get this I wanted to get the meta energy. Ah, uh, Tuna Borg. Infinis stunned into death. Wait. Wait. Not like this. Can we spawn a mech? Even though we can't move, can we spawn a mech? Hello? Oh no! What have I done? Abandon, run, and exit the main menu are different ones. What have I done? Oh no! Oh shoot. I broke. Oh wait! Oh look at that! I thought I broke it. But no. Uh, to be fair. 
it, I also want to make it clear. Bugs are, you know, totally understandable when I am playing pre-early access as well. And the fact that that was the first bug that we noticed and it wasn't even bad, I, and I was able to fix it, neat. It's, it's pre-early access. It'll come out in early access on the 10th. But I guess uh, I, I really... I. I got to I got to I got to go eat. <laughs> I got to go eat as much as I would love to just keep on playing. Uh I may have to play more of this after the uh after the sponsorship thing here. Uh cuz quite frankly, this was this was super super fun. Uh as mentioned, there is I'm going to the Steam page right now. Uh just to make it clear. It is going to be in early access August 10th. This was sponsored by Lion Code Games. There is a link at the top of the description. If you click that one to go to the Steam page, it's basically like a let them know I sent you button. Uh, if, if you you can obviously go via the normal like Steam page, everything like that. You can find it. You can wishlist it if you watch this uh, the day that the video came out. It'll be out in two days. Uh, but yeah, if you if you go go to wishlist it via the link or, or or buy it via that link, it's like a hey he sent you. I don't get a cut of the sales or anything. It's just just like. Show them, show them some love, because uh, I'm really happy that they reached out for this opportunity. Uh, because I I saw this game, and it looks good, and I heard good things, and I, I was interested in playing. Uh, but there's just so many things out that sponsorships like this just help bump things up the queue to the to the top. Otherwise, I might I just genuinely might never get to them. So a huge thank you to them for, for uh, making such a good product and, and for reaching out for the sponsorship. This was a, this was a blast. I, I want to play more of this. I really, I really like this. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. Check out my channel. I put out videos on roguelikes and more every single day. So hit the old like button, comment down below. Let me know if you want to see me uh, more Mech Armada. I could absolutely be convinced to play more of this. I really liked it. Uh, I'm super attached to my st <laughs> stupid little Tuna Borg. Tuna Borg Mark One, Father Spider, Thickbot 900, and Mario. Like, when you can take mechs and put it into a situation where someone might want to make fan art about because they appreciate the mech they made, you know, like the fact that I would uh, I would love to see a Thickbot 900 and Tuna Borg <laughs> Tuna Borg Mark One fan art, and these are like robots that normally I kind of have a harder like I have a harder time emotionally resonating with them, uh, in, in general, you know. So it's just neat. They did a really good job here at at making the customization of the robots feel really special, uh, like. Every run, I, I imagine, like, is going to feel quite different if you want to, if you want it to, if you really let it. Like, these passives, uh, each robot you can create, you can go all kinds of different style. I, you could Zerg Rush, you could, you could make a big army of dinky little droids that are only worth, like, one. Or you could have, a, you know, you could have, like, nine groups of, of dinky little one-drop units, and then, like, and then a thick bot. I'm just... My mind is racing with the, the different possibilities of what you can do with this. Uh, I really like it. Highly recommend it. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel, as I mentioned. Indies every day with an extra specialty on roguelikes. Thank you, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye.